In this video, I will give you 6 easy tips to increase DPS at Verzik. This will be going over P3 pre-tornado. The first tip is attacker. Verzik has multiple mechanics that distract you and pull you away from her. The sooner you understand that, the more opportunities you will see to attack. Popping Nylos. Learning to pop Nylos effectively is an extremely useful skill, not only for P3, but P2 as well. If you don't pop Nylos effectively, they can and will kill you. Your max hit is 65. Pair that with Verzix attacks and you can easily get stacked out for 90 HP. If you just do the run around method and wait until they explode on their own, then you're really losing out on a whole phase worth of damage, a whole special rotation. Plus, it's not going to set you up for our next tip either. Run webs. Webs are super simple. It's free damage. 7 free attacks per person per webs. 7. In a 4 main team, that's 28 extra attacks. 28 extra attacks for free without her being able to hit you. Brewing effectively is something that most people learn while they're in the theater of blood. It's a simple strategy. Attack, sip a brew. Attack, sip a brew. Attack, sip a brew. Attack, restore. Attack, reboost your stats. Doing the sip potion attack method. In a standard brewing sequence, you weave in an extra 4 attacks. Although your stats are at 50, this is much better than not attacking at all. Sometimes those extra 4 attacks could be the difference between getting a KC and not. Numero 5, Minimal Healing. An advanced strategy to increase DPS at Verzik is to assume your teammates are good and don't brew until you're 30 HP. This will allow you to attack as many times as possible with boosted stats while minimizing the time spent eating up. One melee or wrong prayer is deadly at this HP level though, so beware and only do it with people that you trust. This is a really common strategy among speedrunners, so if that's you, this is a tip for you. But if you're just an average player looking to get KC, then I don't recommend doing this. Tip number six is use your time effectively. Did you miss webs? That's all right. Just use the time running around the room to heal up to full and get ready for the next opportunity you have to hit the boss with melee. I view this as a zero loss since you have already missed webs. Come out fully healed, potted, and ready to DPS. The same idea can be applied to yellows as you see here. Once you arrive on your yellow, brew up to full since you can't do anything else. Please hit the like button and share it with your friends. Also, a big thing that'll help me out too is if you watch another one of my videos. Thank you so much.